Our systems is a modern application development platform that consists of various tools available at different stages of software development lifecycle. Let's see what these tools are. To start with, in our systems, you have environments. These are your dev, test, and production. What you also get is a DevOps tool, which is called Lifetime. Typically, when a developer builds his application, let's say using his laptop, he develops the application using a tool called Service Studio or he builds extension using the integration studio. These are the two IDs available for developers. Both of these are thick clients using which the developers are able to build application. And then using the green one-click publish, they push the application to the dev environment. This is where uh, the application as well as the environment can be managed by a tool called Service Center. Think of this as an environment management console. What that means is, in case you want to look at the monitoring, the logs, the versions in developer environment, you will access the service center of this environment. As can be understood, service centers are available for each environment. So in this diagram's case, you will have three service centers. Now, after the application is there available in developer environment, perhaps the developers will do some sort of unit testing and some sort of basic testing of the application and they would want to push it to the test environment for UAT and further testing of the app. In this case, what they will do is using the lifetime, they will push the application to test environment. So now the application becomes available in the test environment. And likewise, when the UAT is complete, they will also push the application to production where now the end users can start using the applications. So these are your production applications. Now all of this that infrastructure that you see here, starting from here to all these consoles and environments, in our systems, this is called an infrastructure. Okay, infrastructure. This is what you get in one license. Now there's also one distinction. In case you're using the free personal environment, you don't have something like this. What you have probably is uh, this part, which is one environment. Okay. Now, how to access these consoles? Uh, as I mentioned, Service Studio and Integration Studio are available in your desktop. So just look for uh, these two tools. Awesome Service Studio is the visual ID that allows you to build any web or mobile application with drag and drop. And then there's also Integration Studio that allows you to write your own code, create extensions, extend uh, by integrating to external databases, and so on and so forth. Thereafter, you have these environment management console service centers for each of these environments. You can access them over the browser, or you can also use this shortcut here, the cogwheel icon that immediately brings you to the uh, service center of that particular environment that you're connected with. Service center can be used for monitoring, version management, and so on and so forth. Going back, how about the lifetime? The last console, it's also available. I mean, a shortcut for accessing this is available under any of the service center. So you can see here, uh, we are in the dev environment and if we want to access all the environments, we can access the lifetime by clicking here. Each of these URLs can also be directly accessed. So in case you want to make them favorites in your browser, please do so. These are the things that you often access in our systems. So once I access the lifetime, this is my governance console. By the way, there are also some pre-built applications available under service center, each of these service centers. For example, your end user management, your feedback management, your BAM reports, which are used for workflows. Okay. So likewise, some of the applications are available and they're available for each environment. So that's how you access any of the tools in our systems. Thanks for watching.